The micronizing success story began in 1970 when an English farmer looking to improve the nutritional value of his animal feed developed a unique system which was to revolutionize the cereal, soya and cocoa processing industries. Now Micronizing Company UK is recognized worldwide for its major contribution to high energy and performance diets for livestock, pets and people. And all because of a unit of infrared energy, the Micron. Cereals have always played an important role in balanced nutrition, providing nearly two-thirds of our energy intake. However, as most of the goodness in raw cereal is locked up in the form of starch, it needs to be treated to make it digestible. The key is the micronizing, short-time, high-temperature cooking process. Cereals, as well as cocoa beans, seeds, beans and pulses, are heated by infrared energy in a matter of seconds. As the starches are converted to sugars, there is a significant improvement in flavour and also in digestibility, especially for younger animals. A starch gelatinisation in maize as high as 85%, with an impressive 98% for barley. Because drying isn't necessary, energy is saved and excessive water loss is avoided. In 1972, the first micronizer was installed at Charnwood Milling, sister company of Micronizing UK. The original plant runs as well today as it did then and is now one of a growing number of micronizers making a real difference in the consumer foods and animal feeds industries across the globe. Building on the successes of the past, at the company's headquarters in eastern England, an in-house team of design engineers using state-of-the-art technology is constantly looking at innovative ways to increase performance. For example, to improve quality control, Micronizing has introduced a new online product temperature monitor to, as ever, recognized European standards. In primary cocoa processing, Micronizing has revolutionized the industry with a unique pretreatment process. As the beans pass under the infrared burners, they are continuously vibrated so that all surfaces are treated equally and heated very quickly, resulting in the shell and nibs separating easily. Less energy is needed for nib roasting without the shell, so there is less contamination and the flavor is tastier. This results in improved productivity and increased customer profits. Elsewhere in the consumer, pet food and animal feeds industries, Micronizing has been supplying equipment for the manufacture of a range of ingredients for bread, soya, cereal products, snack foods and soup mixes. A heat recycling system has been developed, boosting output by 25%, just part of Micronizing's ongoing research and development program, as Managing Director Roderick Newton explains. Also, we have concentrated on the water pretreatment side of the process. Uh, accurate amounts of water are important and with this particular unit, uh, the Vibronet, we're able to save time during the damping process, therefore speeding up the process of uh, micronizing. In addition, with our laboratory, we're able to offer a service to both existing customers and new clients to show the kind of improvements that we can achieve in the food products across the board. And uh, this has made a big difference to uh, our ability to talk to customers. Here at Einstein Brothers, we have dealt with uh, Micronizer UK for the past 22 years. We have found that the process is very, very reliable and successful in the manufacture of flake products into the pig and pet food sectors. customers in 42 countries, from China to Canada, with no challenge too great. Here in Germany, a new micronizer makes a smooth entry through an 8th floor window, ready for installation. And should any problems arise in the future, one of Micronizing's after-sales service team is only a plane ride away. 400 machines installed in every continent, a success story for this millennium, beating the competition into the next.